Story Otis. You ain't planning on going back down into the mall, are you? I wouldn't do that if I <gasps> It's fucking stairs now. No more do I have to wait for fucking spastics to climb this joke. Natalie heads. You have you seen my wife, Natalie? She should still be around. Where the fuck did you come from? Thank God you're okay. Oh, Natalie, I'll never let you go. I shouted over my shoulder. Have you seen my wife? What the fuck? I didn't even see you, you prick. Easy peasy up the stairs. There's fucking loads of space here as well. Room for activities and all. I'm never going to the mall again as long as I live. I've had about enough of this. Natalie, I'm not being bad. You might never be leaving the mall again. It's like we're back in it. Can I? Oh my god. I can still do things when I'm on the fucking phone. Oh my god, this is gonna be the best game in the world. Zombies, huh? Had a feeling you'd show up. The zombie in high heels, Frank. Think for a second. Who do we know in high heels? God, it's you. Roll the credits. Don't sneak up on me. Brad was attacked. I located him on the monitor. It, it's probably just a sprain. I've got to help Brad. Or he's done for. All right, fine. Give me your gun. Come on. I'm the reason you just got hurt. Let me help. No, I can't let a civilian do that. That's against regulations. Yeah, well, I don't think they had zombie-infested malls in mind when they wrote those regulations, kid. Kid? You know how to use this? Kinda. I've covered wars, you know. He has covered wars. He has covered wars. Gurmila. Look, after I'm through helping you, you and I are gonna have a nice little chat. Can move around aiming now. Oh my god, game of the year. Alright, let's get ourselves some fucking shoes. Okay, two more times the charm. Can you guys do me a favor and pretend that you didn't see those first two shots? Whee! Ay, ay, ay. Ooh, no. Skateboard, maybe? Some nice kicks. Okay, all right. Okay, okay, okay. What the fuck? A fucking skateboard or a surfboard? What the fuck? Here I am, doing everything I can. Holding on to what I have, pretending I'm a superman. Ouch. Here I am! Alright, ready to fucking kick ass and chew bubblegum and meet the old brother-in-law. For the first time again. <laughs> Hello! You're shaking your head for. You don't know how capable I am. Girlfriend sent me to find you. Who? Jesse? Damn it! Damn it! Okay, we'll have to talk about this later. You know how to use that gun? I've never fired at a person. First time for everything, Frank. All right, I'll cover you from here. You need to stick to the shadows. And what am I supposed to do when I get close? Well, the best solution would be to shoot the guy. Ah. But if you can't do that, keep him busy dodging your bullets and stay out of trouble. Are you up to it? I'm a lot better with a camera. But yeah, I'll give it a shot. All right. Next time he reloads, I'll lay down a suppressing fire. Suppressing fire? Sounds fancy. I'm counting on you. Make your way over there. One, 
two, three. Uh, I've got you covered. Look for an opening. Dang. I would like to take a picture first. Damn it, you fucking asshole. You camera shy? After it. Don't let him get away. Or what? Right. See that fucking flick? Easy peasy. I sure hope he doesn't Batman away. Oh, that was the one thing I didn't want to happen. He got away. Who was that anyway? I don't know. I'm not sure about the voice actor, but I like the new model. Really leans into how like sleazy he was. Hello? Thanks for your help. The name's Brad. I'm Frank West, photojournalist. And right now I'd rather have an explanation than your thanks, Brad. Sorry. I've got nothing to tell you. Look. Yeah, I get that. I don't know. I'm what picking up what you're putting down. But as far as I'm concerned, we're through working together. But so Brad. you cover your zombie story and leave the rest to us. We were a dream team back there. You uh you guys are looking for someone here, aren't you? Hmm? See, I'm a super genius and I put it all together. Who is that? Where did you choose? You help it? me, I help you. Playing hard to get, look at him. You're one hell of a journalist, aren't you, Frank? Some people say asshole. A hot-headed, underhanded, hot-shot paparazzi with nothing better to do than to invade people's privacy. Hey, I thought that I was tried. Homeland Security's job. You got a point? <laughs> <laughs> Great big burger. Let's work together. No, I don't really feel like it now. Jesse and I are DHS agents, and yes, we are looking for the man in that picture. You're with Homeland Security? Is that guy a terrorist or something? I took that picture in the entrance plaza. Right near the front door. The entrance plaza. You're sure? Yeah. Hey! So do I have your permission to cover this story? Or not? You can cover whatever the fuck you want. I don't think we're getting out of here, bud. Oh, now we gotta do the walk back. Ugh. Brad, do you wanna play Ice Boy? Hold on, I wanna check if my pipe is still here. God damn it, Brad, you despawned my pipe. No, not like that. Mind your toes. Starting to regret letting you tag along for Ah, seat. shut up. Look, come here. Smile. Perfect. Well, now, look. Brad's great and all. I don't know about perfect princess. I've got somebody else in mind. And I can't say her name yet because uh, we haven't been properly introduced. The queen? Hmm. True. I still like to call her my pretty princess. Or whatever that is in Spanish. Oh, Brad, what are you doing? Fucking caked up out here. Sir, mm -hmm. if you could just kindly come with us, we can wrap this whole thing up. No, I'm not leaving until you can Absolutely, guarantee sir. me safe if passage just open through this these. Gate. Just open this no. gate. It's for I am your not protection. opening any gate. Thank you very much. I'm going to uh, stay right do here. Dr. Barnaby. Sir. Thank you. Doc Dr. Barnaby. <clears throat> Doc. Any what, look? What happened? <laughs> you can't just arrest him? He turned down my offer to protect him. Said he isn't going anywhere until I can guarantee a secure route out of here. 
Jesse has a direct line to HQ. The first thing we need to do is to call for backup. All right. If you want to change into some fresh does, just take what you need from the clothing shop. Ooh. Good show, Otis. Let's check out how this fucking suit looks. All right. Uh huh. Stop fucking shit! Ah! I don't know if I'm just better than I was once upon a time. I feel like the skateboard is a lot easier to control. Might have something to do with it being fucking huge. Let's go and talk to our friend, shall we? Where is he? There you are. Hey, you! You're in my way. Good. <clears throat> You're in my way. Can't Good. You see, I'm hard at work. I'm trying to take some pictures here. Hey, yeah. Uh, you're fucking asked. Sorry about that. You know I happen to be a pro too. Maybe not as good as you, but. Think you're a professional, huh? Uh huh. Huh? Right. Gotcha. Do you really appreciate? Yeah, watch this. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's say that again. Third time, lucky. Okay, okay. Hang on a sec, buddy. Why don't I do you a favor? I'll have a look at your technique and Do I look like I need technique from you? I just scarf down three fucking pies. Yeah, what a great yeah, idea, yeah, huh? Yeah, Sometimes yeah. I th but not just any picture will do, Frankie. You have to get 500 pp for my image. Perfect. Ooh, lens flare. Nice job. I look damn good in that shot. Do you think so? Okay. What do you say we change locales? His voice isn't as annoying. Although, maybe it's too early to say. Show me your cool pose, bro. Oh. Alright, take it easy. Let me explain. Get the camera ready and just Perfect. take a shot. Yeah! Okay. Hmm. Well, it's in focus. And uh, the composition's okay, I suppose. Uh huh. Hmm. That ain't half bad. Hey, right, thanks, bro. Okay, here comes the next one, Frankie. But first, feast your eyes on my work. Now this is my most emotionally moving shot. Okay. <laughs> now this is my funniest shot. <laughs> <gasps> He's not a pervert. Uh-huh. Uh okay, okay. This is my most violent shot. He's not a pervert anymore. Check it out. Ugh. Okay, here's the deal, Frankie. You gotta go out there and take even better pictures than the ones I just He doesn't showed. get to go, this is my sexiest shot. Yeah. That's right. Well, I throw a few, uh, whatchamacallits on some whatchamahoosits. This will get me 500, won't it? Perfect. There we go. Let's finish off this case, we'll save. And then we'll, uh... Head down to fucking Tweedledum and Tweedledee, I suppose. Hmm. So that's what Dr. Barnaby said, huh? The old coot's not dumb. He wants us to call for help first. We got a line out or what? The signal's being blocked. I can't even contact HQ on the emergency line. Blocked? Who's doing that? So, if we want to get our hands on Dr. Barnaby, we're going to have to secure a way out of here ourselves. <sighs> All right, we got to deal with the situation we've been handed. The boneheads back at HQ might be working on something, too. There's a helicopter coming. Three days from now. At noon, it's my ride. Is your ride reliable? Absolutely. That's how I plan on getting out of here. All right, then. I'll see to it that the DHS picks up the charter fee. Can we take Dr. Barnaby as well? Sure. As long as you tell me what's going on. Okay. I'll tell you what you want to know. Later. We have more pressing business right now. 
If we have to wait here for three days, we'll need supplies. Um, water, blankets and the like. We'll get Dr. Barnaby here tomorrow morning. And orange juice. An eye on the monitors. 